I am Corporal Mike Hansbury of the Royal Military Police, currently attached to Charlie Company, 40 Commando, based here in Sangid, Helmand Province. Yeah, I mean, basically, it's the same role for RMP throughout uh, Helmand, to be honest. Uh, I've only been with uh, 40 Commando for the last couple of weeks, uh, before which I was with One Mercy. In. It's, it's pretty much the same wherever you are. You're an extra person, obviously part of the patrol. If we suspect somebody has been an insurgent, possibly Taliban, then obviously we, we know the process to go through to get the information and make sure the procedure is carried out correctly. Yeah, on, on the patrol today, obviously, uh, I was riding the quad. Obviously, quite a bit of kit bouncing around in the back. Um, so, and there's no metal roads, so it's sort of up and down through the uh, through the wadis and stuff. Um, it's a bit more fun, and obviously, you're not having to tab along with it, but. Uh, you are slightly more vulnerable, obviously raised up and a bigger target, but uh, it's, it's, it's good fun. Yeah, I mean, basically as a patrol back uh, on the quad is still another uh, rifle. So, uh, yeah, any time sort of go for, uh, you've got the rifle on the front, you can have it off there in seconds just by releasing it. Uh, gives good eyes on. Obviously, I've got a bit more elevation if need be to, uh, to uh, scan the area. Uh, I think pretty much every patrol base and um, FOB that I've been in, it, it's always good. It's one of the first questions that uh, well, most people I know will ask is uh, what, what gym facilities you got. And uh, usually in, in patrol bases like this, they're self-made, uh, using pickets, sandbags and you know basically whatever else. I think we've got some dumbbells that we've uh, got shamuli cases and batteries taped into it. It doesn't make masses of weight, but in the heat and sort of... Not eating massively, it's, it's enough weight to be lifting, to be honest. It's, it's different here, uh, obviously Sangin, um, where I came from the uh, green zone of the Goresh Valley before, so, but day-to-day -day routine within, within the patrol base. You know, you've got, we've got a good running river, the Hellman runs sort of through the compound, uh, so we can wash, wash in there, wash the clothes in there, and it's just good for cooling down, obviously in the heat. Uh, that, I'll put that at 250 but at an angle like so. I'd, I'd, yeah, I'll keep it at 250 but come slightly yeah. there. Yeah, basically today uh, we took some accurate incoming fire from uh, an enemy position which we uh, managed to positively identify and me and a few of the other lads that were up into uh, stand two positions were able to bring on some accurate fire into that position, uh, obviously working together. It just goes to show, really, that it doesn't really matter what cat bad you are when you're in these patrol bases or fobs, you know, everybody's getting stuck in together.